Hey, what is going on guys? It is Michael Shear, your second favorite stock options trader. And what I have for you today is another pe or perpetuation, <laughs> that's the word, for what is going to go on this week, I believe, in AMC stock. So, not only is there perpetuation, there is perpetuation in this video as well because I'm just one of the 1,000 videos out there that you will hear about AMC stock. It's going to be all over the news. Uh, it's because we have another short squeeze going on. Uh, so there's three things I want to talk about. And so that I hope that it is educational and you least understand what is going on. Yet again, uh, we have the game stock, uh, game stop, not game stock, uh, game stock rocket to the moon when it was like it like 20 bucks ran up to 400 in the pre-market and came crashing back down and honestly it's actually stopped a lot higher than i expected it to i thought this thing was going to go back down to like 10 15 but it's kind of been holding its own in the 100 range uh but we are not here to talk about gamestop we are here to talk about amc the new run up the new meme stock of the day so Let's kind of go on and talk about a couple of things. Uh, one is going to be the uh, fear of missing out. Second is going to be pure speculation. And lastly, I'm going to talk about my position so that you can kind of get an idea of what somebody like myself, if you are following me, is going to be doing with this stock. So FOMO happens every time especially in these meme stock days, these get rich quick days. Not only is it bad for new investors, it is just, I think it's, it might be kind of good actually, because it gets you into the market. And I think the best thing you can do is feel a little bit burned sometimes. Cause could you imagine still being a person to hold on to $200 uh, buy order on GameStop right now and still just chilling with it? Still at a loss after you've seen a, a double in your account? Well, that's exactly what's about to happen again here in AMC from what I believe. I think that people are going to jump in, getting way too excited because their favorite YouTuber is sitting here pumping this stock up. And I believe it will run. That's the thing. These stocks are going to be all over the news. It's going to be all over CNBC, all over MSNBC. You're going to see it on all the financial news and, of course, your favorite YouTubers as well uh, we have to talk about it it is the news it is the big deal in the financial markets right now uh, it's just a lot like our cryptos that are going on they're going down and we need another way to make some plays to hopefully make some crazy quick money overnight so FOMO fear of missing out do not be one of these people if you see AMC at a hundred dollars don't you dare be buying I don't care if this thing runs up to a thousand it is so crazy to get into something when it's already up 400%. <sighs> Just do, don't, don't fall into the trap. Don't fall into the trap of quick, easy money. It's going to the moon. It's never stopping. People like this one, run the B-roll. $100,000 stock evaluation by the math? Come on now. That would make AMC like the biggest company in the world. It doesn't make sense. It's not going to happen. There is infinite money in these hedge funds. Yeah, they may lose a couple billion dollars and they may be like going out of business for two or three of them. But there's infinite money out there. They're going to shove this thing back down. Do not be that one person or those two or three or thousand people that lose all your money in this play. Lastly, the best way to stay away from FOMO is if you are going to make the play. Do it with some money that you don't or are not scared of losing. All right, speculation, pure speculation. So again, it goes back to the FOMO idea. This is a very, very speculative play that I think that we actually should kind of get into. Test the waters again with money you are okay with losing. Speculation just means that you're getting into something that you think has high amounts of volatility, not risk, high amounts of volatility Risk is what you define it as. So if you have your stop loss set up, you're only risking what you put in. Do not let this thing go all the way to zero. It just doesn't make sense. Set some stop losses, 
when you speculate you're looking for big moves you know the volatility is there amc has the volatility the volume is going to be there this stock is going to be doing a absolute roller coaster ride this week and i just want you all to be prepared for it for my positions i have i have done three orders so far i believe i am averaged in at 26 27 dollars uh, so I have uh, three buys, 25 shares a piece. I think that's it for me. I'm just going to sit here, hold it. Uh, if it goes above $30, I will then set my stop loss at $30. See what happens. Either way, I want to make some money. And I will then trail that stop up as it goes up. So if it breaks over yesterday's or Friday's high of, I believe it was 36, then it's again time to raise our bar up get our trailing stop loss in there so that nothing happens. So even if it goes back down to 19, 18, 14 bucks, you're already out. That's why we set those parameters, we set those stop losses, and we try to make our money while it's in there. So even if the stock runs up past 30, I move my stop loss up, it comes down, hits 29, blows me out, and next thing you know, it rips to 80, 90, $100. I'm not gonna be mad, I made money. It's okay. Take your money while it's good because you don't know. That's the point of speculation. That's the point of not getting into fear of missing out. And you have now seen my position. Guys, take advantage of this time. Get excited. Don't fall into these traps. Don't get into FOMO. Don't be buying at 100 plus. Don't be thinking, oh, this thing's going to $100,000 share stock price. It's not. It's not going to happen. Understand your risk by putting on a stop loss. That's your risk. If you're risking all the way to zero, you're risking way too much. All right, guys, this is Michael Shear. This is your favorite stock options trader. And I hope that you guys have a good Memorial Day. And for this week, be ready. Be on the lookout because AMC is going to make some moves. So be prepared. Be ready. Be on the lookout. And guys, if you think this new shirt is sweet, Sheer Prosperity just got my first shirt out. It looks pretty dope. Um, also, if you like the shirt and you like this video, go ahead and hit that like. Hit the subscribe button, guys, and be on the lookout for AMC tomorrow. And let's have a great week of trading. Take care.